today I'm going to show you guys how to get rid of Planaria Hydra and Scutellaria Japonica all in one video. Let's do this. A quick word of warning before we get started and that is that no Planaria will also kill snails. Get yourself some no Planaria. I have no Planaria in here. This is not the original packaging but I will leave a link in the first comment of where you can actually buy no Planaria for yourself that is a non-affiliate link. Next you will need a way to measure your no planaria because we're going to add it to a container. I've chosen a Coca-Cola bottle because you guys will all be able to get this. Any kind of container is good but I just want to show you that anything is possible. Next take your cola bottle and half fill it up with water from the aquarium that you're going to dose with no planaria. Take your little scoop like this and get your planaria, no planaria, and take out a flat level spoon of the powder like this. And this weighs roughly 0.2 grams, which is roughly uh, 1 16th of a teaspoon, roughly. Right, so add this powder to your bottle like this, and then put the cap on. and give it a good shake for roughly about 30 seconds like this. Take your fluid that you've just made with your no planaria and your bottle and pour it in guys all the way around the primer like this making sure that you get all the glass covered all the way around. Right and what this will do is it will ensure that your hydra on the sides if that is your issue it will make sure that they get a good dose of no planaria put on top of them. On day 14 which is two weeks after your first dose you can use something like this which is active carbon to remove any medication that may be left over in the tank. 